Hi, my name is Tony Wager and I'm a poet. Today, I've been sat at home trying to flatten the curve of infection. It was glorious. The sun was streaming in through the open window. A multitude of birds were declaring the love for the day outside. The kettle and a full biscuit tin were only a step away. What could possibly be better? Ten hours later, having had my fill of radio newscasters feeding me the constant updates on the impending disaster, I turned the doom mongers off. With just my thoughts for company, and, I must add, a nearly empty biscuit barrel, I reflect on the fact that my attempt to flatten the curve has served to fatten my belly. It's at this point that I dust off the laptop and dive into the World Wide Web. Wow! A whole different universe opened up in front of me. I can visit foreign countries, dive down to the Great Barrier Reef, even fly into space, all without leaving my kitchen table. No isolation, where is thy sting? It was after this great revelation that I wrote this short poem. It's called Corona. Spring has sprung, the sun is out, the coastline's looking pretty. Skeggy shouts, come visit me, a short drip from the city. I replied, I must abide within these walls, not go outside, but I don't need your pity. Although I cannot meet my friends or travel through the nation, I am joined to all the world by mass communication. I can speak to Pole or Greek, or even those in Mozambique, while sat in isolation. Electronic tourists me through travel on the net. I have sailed the Amazon and trekked across Tibet. I have been through laptop screened lands that I'd have never seen if I'd have travelled on a jet. Boredom isn't staying in, it's more a state of mind. Though I cannot go outside, my soul is not confined. It's flying free across land and sea as internet brings friends to me, one click away from all mankind. If you enjoyed this short poem, please like and share. God bless you and keep you safe. Hope to see you again soon.